Here we go, guys. We're going to do the 1920 Parkhurst Blaster. So this product actually doesn't come in hobby. This is pretty much the most packs you can get in a box is from this blaster. You can get autographs. They're extremely rare. Uh, overall, it's a pretty low-end product, but I figured it'd be fun. I never really opened Parkhurst of any of the other years. I have a couple of the cards, obviously, from here and there, but this is the first time I opened a actual box or, like, rack pack or anything of Parker. This is 1920. So we'll see what we get. Hopefully. Hopefully we can get one of those prominent prospect autographs, but they are pretty rare. And this is a massive set to 320 cards. So any of the parallels, it would be nice just to get some good players. Because there's a lot of players from a lot of teams. There you go. You get it says 10 cards per pa uh, 10 packs per box, but you're getting 12 cards per pack, so it's actually 120 cards in here. So it's a fairly heavy blaster compared to most. There you go. There are the 12 packs. And here we go. First look at this, so I'm going to go through these fairly fairly slowly. As usual, the Parker's is a little bit of a green design. I do like the white. A lot of people don't like the white around cards. They've done this for a lot of products, Parker's every year. But I like it because you have, when you have a parallel, it's very easy to distinguish the parallel and it goes all the way around, makes it much more uh, much more significant of an, of an insert than just if it was a little, little red here and there. So that's the base card there, there's the back. And they're all right. Brett Pesci, Patrick Kane, Nino Niederreiter. Well, there you go. That's a nice one right there. Quinn Hughes rookie. That's one of the best ones this year. I mean, again, these are not worth that much, but if you're going to get a rookie, get the Quinn Hughes. Tyler Sagan. And there's our prominent... I think we get one of these per box. These are basically the chase cards. You can get autographed versions of these. This is Nikita Gusev, prominent prospects. Insert. Andreas Atanaseu. Bobby Ryan, Eric Carlson, and Ricard Raquel. So there's pack number one. It's also strange to have such so many cards in a pack. Usually we're used to like the six or the eight from upper deck. Duncan Keith, Jordan Everly, Jordan Bennington, Pierre-Luc Dubois, a Cody Glass rookie, an all-star of Drew Doughty, a Jordan Bennington Silver. So as you can see, like it's very easy to distinguish the the parallels. I, I just like it better like that. Claude Giroux, Nikita Kucherov, and Gabriel Landeskog. Sean Couturier, Anze Kopitar, Jake Gensel, Philippe Myers, rookie. All-star Marc-Andre Fleury. These are called, uh, this is Brady Shea. I think these are just called Parkies or Parker's, Parker's Parallel. Brady Shea. Yanni Gourd. Vincent Henestroza. Jamie Benn. And Casey Sezikis. <clears throat> they don't feel that bad as cards either. Like, um, sometimes these low-end products feel a bit flimsy. But these are fairly, fairly decent stock. Paul Stastny. Chris Kreider, Jonathan Huberdo, Tori Krug, a Capo Caco rookie. I think he was the second overall pick or the third overall pick. So two good rookies so far. P.K. Subban. Oh, that's nice. Hailstorm, Carey Price. I mean, these aren't worth that much either, but they look really nice. Hailstorm, Carey Price. It's good for my PC, the Habs. Very shiny. John Tavares, Corey Schneider, and William Nylander. Ryan Nugent Hopkins, Elias Pettersson, Zach Parise, a rookie of Nico Sturm. And there we have a view from the ice. Sidney Crosby. Again, these are these are pretty nice. I think all of the parallels have a red version that are pretty rare as well. This is obviously the not non-red, but Franz Nielsen, Sam Bennett, JVR, 
and Nick Foligno. Travis Sajak, Jack Voracek, Ben Bishop, Jeff Skinner, not having a great year, Alex Ovechkin, a rookie of Noah Dobson, not bad one there, and Zdeno Chara, silver, Dmitry Orlov, Connor Sheary, and Jaden Schwartz. Like I said, so this is good for entry level collectors, kids. You get a lot of cards. You can go open for a long time. A lot of stuff to look at. Brings people into the hobby. Brock Besser. Jason Zucker. Shea Weber. Rookie of Guillaume Brisebois. All-star of Claude Giroux. Alexander Radulov. Parkies. Parkhurst insert. Jesper Bratt. Tom Wilson. Jimmy Howard. And Sven Berchi. Timo Meyer, Philippe Grubauer, John Carlson, Tyson Yost, rookie of Dennis Gilbert, Steven Stamkos. I don't know if there's photo variations, but it's weird that there's a base behind the, um, that doesn't say all-star. So I'm going to put that aside just in case. Hailstorm of Elias Pedersen. Peterson. <laughs> Again, don't really know. Giordano, Kapanen, and Wenberg. So four packs left here. Nicholas Backstrom, Logan Kutsero, Aaron Ekblad, a rookie of Carter Verhage, another pretty decent one. Again, Taylor Hall. These are 250 and above. Stankos was 251, so they might be like short prints or something. Review from the ice of Drew Doughty. Charlie McAvoy, Lars Eller, Nico Heischer, and Michael Backlund. Thing with these packs is they shred. They're fairly thin packs, like the actual packaging. Dylan Strom, Sidney Crosby, Mark Stone, Ivan Provorov, rookie of Caden Fulcher. Oh, I'm curious if this is over 250. It's not. I'm going to keep putting them aside just in case. Hampus Lindholm, silver. So this is what you're kind of not hoping to get out of the silvers. You're hoping more for a Crosby and McDavid. <clears throat> so they know Chara wasn't that bad. Bennington, not bad either with the Stanley Cup champion. Travis Hamannick, Nate Schmidt, Chris Russell. There's a nice one there. Kel McCarr, rookie. I, if I had to guess right now, I would assume he's going to be the rookie of the year. James Neal. And there's an Austin Matthews, Parkies, Parkers, Silverberg, Stahl, Hornqvist, and Hellebuck. And our last pack here. So our prominent prospect wasn't that good. It was Gusev. He's, I think he's on. he was on the Golden Knights, but I believe he's back in the KHL already. Roberto Luongo, Ryan Getzlab, Sebastian Aho, Craig Anderson, Josh Curry, rookie. Brad Marchand. Here we have a gold, so I guess you got one of these per blaster. Mikhail Sergachev, I mean, not great. Not terrible. He was a Habs prospect. Got traded for Drouin, which he's injured right now, so can't really complain about him too much. And there we go. So, there, so I mean, it's a good entry-level product. You're getting a lot of cards, a lot of rookies. You think you got a rookie per pack. Um, as for, like, collectors who... I mean, like for us, most of the people watching this that open hobby boxes, this is pretty low end, but still a fun break. You can see here all the cards. You're getting, you're getting a lot of cards. You're getting a lot of cards. So thanks for watching, guys. Like, subscribe, and peace.